Let me know if you guys need me. Hi. Hi everybody, thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Katie and in today's video, I am going to be showing you guys what I packed in my hospital bag. So if you're interested, then stay tuned. Let's go. Okay, so a couple things before I start going through my hospital bag that I've packed. Um, I just wanted to give like a little bit of an update. So I am currently almost 39 weeks. So in two days, I'll be exactly 39 weeks. And so she can come at any time. I'm just patiently waiting for her to come. I don't, I don't really feel like she is going to be coming super soon. Although I wish that she would because I'm excited to meet her and I feel like I've been waiting forever. Um, but the reason why I say I don't think she's going to be coming super soon is because I just sometimes still feel her like super far up. Um, and so, and I just don't feel like, I don't know. I just can kind of like tell, I don't know if that makes any sense because I've never been pregnant, but um, some other things that have been going on is I have been starting to feel super nauseous again, which some people are saying that makes me it, like, it seemed like she is going to come sooner. So I don't know what's going on, but I'm just waiting for her to come. Um, and so with that being said, I packed my hospital bag. There's still some stuff left that I want to put inside of it. And I'll go over that as well, but let's just unpack what I already have in here. So this is what I put everything in just this duffel bag and I used like I have this app it's called Ovia and I don't have my phone out here but um, on that app there's like so much stuff on it including a like hospital bag checklist so I just went through that and I like checked off like what I packed in here so to start I put some of my um, prenatal vitamins in here because um, I read that you should continue to take the vitamins like afterwards because it's still good for you and especially because you're like if you breastfeed like it's still good for you and the baby um, So I brought some of these so that I can continue to take them every day. I only I actually got a new like new Jar whatever this thing is and so I just put like a couple in here so that I would have it for like a day or two So that's the first thing the second thing in my bag is I packed um, two chargers, one for me and one for Jackson. I need boxes for them. Um, so I was just gonna look and find some because I think we have extra boxes. But um, my dad actually said that we should just have like separate chargers in the bag so that like just in case, you know, if it's like a crazy like, we gotta go right now, then we can just grab the bag and go. Um, and also our chargers break all the time, so it's not bad to have extra, so got those. Okay, next, what's in my bag? I do not think that I'm actually gonna use this, like, but it was on the list from Ovia, the app, and I, if I'm down to, then I will, but I don't think I'm gonna actually read, but this is the book that I've been reading, and so I just put it in there just in case we're bored or I maybe wanna read, I don't know. We're gonna bring it. Oftentimes, though, I do, like when I don't feel good, I really like Jackson reading to me, so maybe he'll read me the book to make me feel better. So maybe it will come in handy, we don't know. And then the next thing in my bag is I packed a hairbrush um, just to brush my hair. I don't know, it's really the use of that. And speaking of like that stuff, I also do wanna pack a toothbrush and toothpaste, although I do think that the hospital's gonna have that. I'm pretty sure I know that they're gonna have that. I think they told us. Um, but I just, I'm going to pick up some toothbrushes tomorrow and just have them in both Jack's and I's bag, or I'm just putting both in my bag, um, just so that we can have like, you know, toothbrushes that aren't like hospital toothbrushes. Who knows what kind of toothbrushes they have, but just so we have our own. Yeah. Okay. The next things that I put in my bag are, we're also on the Ovia like checklist. So I'm not a hundred percent sure. Like, I don't even think that I really need them because I think the hospital's going to have them, but I have these like samples um and so i'm just putting them in there and they're like the nursing pads um because i am gonna breastfeed and so i'm just bringing some nursing pads just in case i need them but i feel like they are gonna have them there but whatever they're not that big and so i can just put them in there okay and then the last couple things in this main area are just a bunch of clothes but i'll kind of go through some of them um i did purchase a couple like actually a couple months ago like some like nursing bras this one is like un I don't even know how to put this back together um, but yeah I'm just gonna bring some nursing bras 
and then I'm also gonna bring some like comfier clothes but still like bigger clothes like I'm not expecting to go back to the size I was beforehand so I have that in here and then um, I also have this dress that I ordered on Amazon and it's supposedly like a you can wear it instead of a hospital gown because it's like kind of the same but it's just cuter and it like has I don't, I don't know I don't know so I got this off of Amazon and everyone was saying that they like delivered in it and that everyone was like oh my god it's so cute and so it's super comfy and soft so hopefully this is what I deliver in because I would rather deliver in this than whatever they give you I don't know so I packed that as well okay so that is everything that's in like this main area for the duffel bag some other things that I do need is my ID I also need my insurance card I need um, I'm gonna print out like the birth plan so that me and Jackson Jackson and I can fill it out um, and so that's the other stuff that I'm working on probably you know by the end of the week I'll have all that stuff I just haven't been feeling the greatest and so I'm trying to get everything done um, beforehand but that's everything I have currently and that's the things I'm still gonna be putting in here but that's like you don't really need to see that it's just gonna be like a piece of paper that I'm gonna put in here and then in this little pocket over here I put all of her stuff in there I keep wanting to say her name <laughs> um, I put some socks I put some blue socks and some pink socks just in case I don't know what will want her to wear I packed her swaddle although I feel like I'm I'm pretty sure that they'll have one for us I packed her two beanies one's like super tiny for her little head and one's a little bit bigger because I obviously don't know how big she's gonna be her head could be even bigger than this I have no idea so I brought those two one's pink one's blue again and then I packed this little outfit because it doesn't have like a bottom and so just in case she's like super huge I wanted to bring her a couple different sizes although this is still newborn so maybe I'll bring a little bit bigger I don't know and then I brought her two more outfits <laughs> um, I'm not gonna show you like the front of them because they say her name um, this one says hello I'm blank with her name and then it goes with these little pants and then this one says hello world I'm blank and it goes with these little pants which I think are so cute and so she has lots of different outfits to try on or for us to decide what should be her going home outfit just in case she's huge or I don't know how we're gonna be feeling that day so I packed all of that just to see maybe she'll decide just kidding okay well that is everything that is in my um, hospital bag Jackson also already packed his hospital bag but he just put like clothes in it um, because he doesn't really need anything I feel like the main thing that we even need you know is just her clothes like her going home outfit and then we obviously already have the car seat in the car because she could come at any time and we want to be ready um, and then the hospital really said like all you need is comfy clothes for me and an outfit for your baby but I'm just bringing those extra things like just because they're more of like just to have I guess I don't really know I think it depends on the hospital but I feel like for the majority they all have like everything that you could possibly even think of and so yeah that's really all I have to say for this video but I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs down if you have anything to say go ahead and in the comments below um, oh yeah if you want to see more videos from me go ahead and subscribe sorry I haven't done this in a while I forgot what I say but other than that peace out have a good day or night or whatever you're doing just do it right Oh, and here's a bump date as well. She is pretty big in there. Go follow Jackson Chili Dog Weathers on Instagram. <laughs> Go away.